Hello and welcome everybody to Oracle Angels Double One Double Two. I'm going to be doing your Twin Flame reading. Pisces, let's start. Okay, I'm going to be doing you on the side, your personal on the side. Please remember to flip and twist the energies. This is not a personal reading, so it won't resonate with everyone, okay? So, Angel Guides, what do we have for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus? You're going to have to excuse me. I am very, very tired. Um, the lockdown is driving me crazy. <sighs> Which I'm sure it is for most people and especially children as well. So, mm. Let's see what we've got for Pisces. Angel Guides, what do we have for Pisces, please? So, Moon, Rising, Venus for the month of April 2020. So, we have a high honour. Okay. What do we have for the person in question that Pisces is dealing with for their Twin Flame reading? What do we need to know for Pisces for the person? Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> they flipped out and went back in. Well, <clears throat> we have coffin. Okay, so that could possibly mean death, okay, or a transformation. Um, let's get some advice cards for you, Pisces. Angel guides, what advice and guidance can we give to Pisces, Semi Rising, Venus for their Twin Flame reading, please? What advice can we give for, okay. What advice and guidance can we give for Pisces, please, for their Twin Flame reading, Angel Guides? Okay. We have um, the personal a personal issue has reached um, resolution, okay? And a new start is coming, okay? Let's get some Oracle cards for you, at Pisces, and then we'll start with your reading. Angel Guides... What advice and guidance can you give for Pisces? What advice and guidance can we give for Pisces? <laughs> what advice and guidance can we give for Pisces? What advice and guidance do we have for Pisces, please? <laughs> Angel guides, what advice and guidance can we have for? <laughs> well, I, I saw that card, but I don't want to read it, and I'm not going to give it away until the end. But it has something to do with this here. Okay. What advice and guidance can we get, have for the person in question that Pisces is dealing with? One more card, please. Thank you very much. Okay. All right. So, okay, let's get on with your main reading, Pisces, Angel Guides, Holy Spirits, Holy Angels. Please give me guidance for Pisces. What do Pisces need to know for their Twin Flame reading for the month of April 2020, please, Angel Guides? I've already gave these cards a very good shuffle, so I'm just going to cut the deck. Okay. So we have the Ace of Pentacles. We have the Five of Wands, we have the Three of Pentacles, we have the Four of Cups, we have Four of Wands, and we have the Two of Wands. Okay. What do we need to know for the person in question, please? What do we need to know for the per person in question that Pisces is dealing with? Cutting the deck, absolutely useless today. <laughs> All right, okay. Message will always be what the angels want to give. So we have the Five of Pentacles, we have the King of Cups, we have the Five of Cups, we have the Page of Pentacles, we have the Two of Swords, and we have Justice. Okay, so you could be dealing here with another water energy here. Um, we have a lot of water, we have a lot of earth, okay, uh, we do have a bit of air and fire, um, and we have Libra energy there, okay, quite strongly, so, let's get, what is working well, please, angel guys, between Pisces and the person in question, what is working well between Pisces and the person in question, please?
So we have the four swords and we have the call, which is judgment. Okay. What is not working well, please, for Pisces and the person in question? I feel that the energies have flipped again. But I'm going to read it as it is. What is not working well, please, for Pisces? What is a blockage between Pisces and this person? We have the Page of Swords and we have the Three of Swords, okay? Your overall energy we have here is the Seven of Cups, okay? So somebody here is um, really concentrating on analysing the situation, trying to get some kind of understanding. They may be trying to gain some knowledge about, um, knowledge in the sense of um, more information about the choices that they need to make, okay? Somebody may already know what the choice is, but I feel that there are some other choices there. This could also be about having options as well, okay? So, um, let's start off with you Pisces, okay, or whoever this is, whether this is the person you're dealing with. We have the Ace of Pentacles to the Five of Wands, okay. The Ace of Pentacles is talking about manifestation, a big opportunity, okay. But with the Five of Wands, I feel here, Pisces, that you are conflicted and you are not sure whether you should take this offer or not, okay. Um, it is something big, okay. Um, I mean, this could be... Um, This could be something as big as finance, okay, a windfall of finance. This could be something as a, um, a person offering you something very big, okay, um, offering to move in to a house, okay, um, together. And I think that you're very conflicted right now, okay, and, and you may feel, okay, um, like this is not the right time for me, okay. So with the uh, Three of Pentacles to the Four of Cups here, I feel that you want to work on this okay you want to work on this connection you there is a part of you that is kind of saying yes okay i want to so it's like your mind is saying yes your body is saying yes but your emotions they're saying whoa this is going way too fast okay uh, whatever this is I, i'm still very much undecided about this okay with the four of pentacles um sorry four of cups being here and i feel that you're trying to really figure out what it is and whether this is the right thing for you to do okay with the four of wands okay to the two of wands i feel here okay that this could be something as like i said as stable as marriage okay moving in together move to a high level of commitment but the two of, um two of wands being there i feel that you're trying to gain the courage to do this okay but i think that you have so much on your mind right now okay and you're looking at this from a different perspective but you're in that stuck energy okay and you're not moving from that stuck energy you're just there thinking okay and analyzing the situation so for your person we have the five of pentacles and we have the king of cups so um pisces whoever this is here okay with the five of pentacles again there's that conflicted energy okay somebody here may feel like you've left them out in the cold you may not have gave this person an answer when they've made an offer to you okay and this person is waiting okay they have they, they're waiting okay they have that emotional control over themselves okay they're control they're in control of their emotions okay towards the situation they're trying to have the courage okay to not act in, in a rational way, in an irrational way, okay, towards the situation. And they may know that you need some time as well, but right now they just feel like, you know, you've left them out, okay, or there's something missing and there's something you're not telling them if you haven't told them about this. With the Five of Cups, okay, um, and the Page of Pentacles, I feel you could be dealing with a younger Earth sign here as well. For some of you, with the Five of Cups, I feel that this person feels at loss right now, okay, because they really had hope for this connection, okay. This person um, may come in and apologise to you. This may, person may come in and, and speak to you, okay. This person may come in and um, have a very... Um, formal conversation with you okay even but i feel that with this childish energy here okay i feel that this person may be thinking um they may have rushed into the situation okay and i think that they may come to the realization that they rushed into the situation okay but they have this kind of um 
disappointed kind of energy in them okay that the, why couldn't this work out why could this not work out okay i'm willing to apologize for what i've done but why can this still not work okay with the two of swords being here and the justice i feel that this person here is at a crossroads and they need to make a, a decision here okay and with the justice card being here i feel that they will end up making that decision because what is going to happen here is is in in the traditional um deck okay um with the two of swords okay there is two swords there and and with the justice there is one sword there which means that they are going to get a breakthrough in the situation they are going to do what is right okay and i feel here that they will come to a decision whatever that decision is okay so let's go in with some clarifiers and see what this is all about angel guards please clarify the reading please for pisces and the person in question all right okay let's go why is the ace of pentacles here please angel guides why is the ace of pentacles here so we have there it is again the king of cups okay um so we have the high priestess with the king of cups i feel that right now pisces there's your energy right there so you could be dealing with another water sign here as well what i feel here is is you're trying to have uh this control um emotional control towards this person okay and not to give in very freely okay so this offer may have come in but you're kind of holding back okay you want to and then you don't so again there's that energy of conf um conflicted mind over heart heart over mind kind of situation here with the high priestess i feel like you're trying to um really use your intuition here okay and get some guidance here in regards to this um this person okay um i think the question is can i trust this person are we moving too soon um you know there may be this kind of conflict here as well is that do i know this person well enough to actually just jump straight in okay why is this person so many questions are coming up for you pisces okay and again um i feel that you may feel that that this connection okay there could have been a potential to have this connection with this person but i feel that you may be disappointed because you feel that this person may be hiding something from you okay as to why they're rushing in so fast or why they've made such a big offer why um you know i think there's just so many whys here um and with this high priestess being here and with the king of cups i feel here that um pisces you really are trying to see the clearer picture in all of this okay and i think that when it's the right time you are going to tell them but right now for you it's not the right time to give them an answer or even tell them clarify the five of wands please angel guides so we have the king of wands uh sorry the knight of wands and we have the two of swords yeah you're conflicted about moving in you think that you may end up moving towards this person very fast okay and you don't want to do that you feel like things are moving way too fast and there's that two of swords energy again conf conflicted okay needing to make a decision not sure what to do i feel that your mind is so busy right now pisces with so many thoughts coming through okay that you can't really think straight at the moment and that clarity is going to come real soon um but i feel here right now with the knight of wands you feel like perhaps this person is moving way too fast okay and maybe they're just you know they're being quite impulsive okay um, this person may have um, a lusty full behavior a childish playful behavior okay and you may be thinking is this person even serious okay where's this going clarify the three of pentacles please angel guides So we have the ace of pentacles six of wands yeah i see it's, it's like mind over heart your mind is saying that you want to take this opportunity you want to move and you feel like it's going to be a good idea it's going to be a successful um combine like this is going to be successful okay if you put the effort in this person puts the effort in there is team building in this there's cooperation in this okay there's growth in this and i think that you want to and your mind is saying this to you but i think that your heart is kind of clashing with what your thoughts are at the moment you know um let's clarify the four of cups 
there it is okay so you've got two fours now okay um so we have the four of swords okay and we have the the temperance here again <laughs> there is that conflicted energy your emotions are like in waves at the moment okay it's like heart over mind again there's that energy and with the four of swords here okay i really feel that you are just taking your time okay you're sitting you're contemplating you may be meditating you may be trying to get the answers okay and your angel guides are guiding you okay your angel guides are guiding you through this could be dealing with a sag here as well let's clarify the four of wands okay so with the eight of cups and the nine of pentacles with the four of wands being here i see that there is stability but i think that somebody here may be i feel okay especially with the nine of pentacles here that i feel somebody here is um is taking a very caution step okay like the the they're playing with caution here okay um that's what i feel here and i do feel here okay that um in this four of wands okay um in regards to the stability i think that somebody here may have come to the realization okay and finally listened to their intuition and decided to walk away from this connection because something was not right okay somebody probably felt here that something was not right um I also feel here that the other message this card could be giving here is that somebody here is kind of turning their back on this connection. Okay, so not necessarily leaving it, but I feel it's kind of like I'm turning my back on this connection because I've got so much going on right now. I can't think straight whether I want this or not. So I'm just going to leave this where it is. Okay, and get on with my own things. That's what this is about. Clarify the two of ones, please, angel guides. So we have the King of Swords and the Hanged Man. Okay. So somebody here has walked away um, for their own peace of mind, for their own clarity. Okay. Um, and I feel here that somebody here is just, just basically hanging there. Okay. They are thinking about things while they're just hanging there. They are going through this transformation within themselves. Okay. I think that with the king of swords and the hangman um this to me here is, is kind of showing up that as in somebody here is trying to empower themselves okay while they're waiting there while they're in that stuck energy they can't make a decision and then walked away so that they could get clarity from this situation um and i think that that's why they're just hanging there right now okay and trying to get some clarity and look at the situation outside of the box rather than being in that kind of conflicted energy okay pass this move to your person clarify the five of pentacles please angel guides so we have the queen of cups and the knight of swords so somebody here feels very left out in the cold and and now we have the queen of cups here as well and I feel here that, yeah, somebody here is conflicted in regards to you, okay? And they're also, I think, um, really focusing on how they feel towards you. And what I see is what they want is that they want to come forward. Um, and, and they may come forward very fast, or this is their energy, wanting to come forward, communicate, okay, um, with you, and um, have a very clear conversation, Okay. But I feel that with the five pentacles energy here, they may not be able to get through to you, okay? Whoever this person is. Clarify the king of cups, please. So we have the empress energy here and we have the seven of pentacles. Somebody really wants to... <sighs> This person can't stop thinking about you, okay? This person has you always in their mind. They want to invest their time with you, okay? This person here wants to invest, um, you know, their compassion, their abundance. They want to really nurture this relationship, okay? And they have this person on their mind all the time, okay? All the time. 
but they feel very much left out in the cold clarify the five of cups please angel guides okay have a lot of five energy here so with the page of wands here with the five of cups i feel that this person okay there's that five again with the five of cups in reverse so we have the five of cups upright and we have the five of cups in reverse okay um i think that this is either your energy here pisces or your person's okay because there's two energies here while somebody's feeling at loss i feel at the same time they know okay that they have to move on and accept the situation for as it is okay um and with the paid of ones they may be ready to look the other way and move away from this connection okay clarify the page of pentacles please angel guides there's that four of wands there again okay so we have the ten of swords to the four of wands okay with the page of pentacles somebody here is really wanting to apologize that things just could not work out i'm i am feeling there's an ending here to this relationship or to this um stability okay i really do and with the tower moment here i think that they've come to the realization that this was never going to work and that they need to they're taking their feelings and moving on okay let's clarify the two of swords please angel guides clarify the two of swords please thank you we have the four of cups there's that energy again with the six of pentacles okay so somebody here is is really conflicted okay they have choices that they need to make okay so i feel here with the four of cups and the six of pentacles are really thinking okay they really they're really thinking here okay as to um as to what to do whether to keep giving into this relationship or whether to start thinking about themselves now okay and move forward because clearly they are still stuck on you okay whoever this person is whether this is cross watch or pisces that this person here is clearly stuck on this person okay and now they're thinking about whether they should carry on waiting and giving um or they may have hope that you know you may turn back around and offer them this you know this cup of love but they also know at the same time that if it's not going to work they need to move forward okay clarify the justice please angel guides so we have the page of swords and the magician okay so somebody here um is decided to cut somebody off and guard themselves okay from this this connection somebody here is is manifesting okay somebody here is manifesting clarity somebody here is manifesting um the truth somebody here is is doing what they feel they need to do now okay that is right for them okay um and with this page of swords being here i feel like somebody is uh, is really guarding themselves up okay but at the same time it's about getting that mental clarity as well okay and um i feel that And I feel that with the justice card being here, there's that sword, see? They've managed to get a breakthrough in a situation for themselves. And um, I think that they, they may as well have walked away from this. Yeah, there it is, the hermit, Virgo energy. They've walked away, they've withdrawn themselves from the situation. They knew that this was a, a soulmate connection. And with the full card being here, they've decided to start a new beginning i'm seeing a lot of young energy here okay so there could be kids involved as well but i really haven't picked that up there's just a lot of young energy so there could be a age difference between you and this person um okay so what is working well for you and this person okay so we have the four of swords and the call so it is actually a, a a karmic the universe here is is guiding you guys okay they're making they're doing this so that you guys can reflect you guys can think okay about what it is the 
it's there to basically help you learn and make the right decisions okay so that's why this situation came up in the first place okay because it was universally guided okay the universe is guiding you to make these decisions okay without taking any um impulsive actions okay um the universe is guiding you to what it needs to guide you to okay it was a learning curve and what is not working well or what are the blockages page of swords um there it is again with the three of swords yeah i feel here that somebody has decided now that it's time they they cut somebody off and it was painful for them but they had no choice but to do it okay block somebody out of their life their mind their thoughts it was painful um but they've had no choice okay so let's see what messages you and this person have be aware of what you are projecting for your qualities you admire in one another are qualities you possess equally so the qualities you don't like are your own reflection so pisces this is telling me here that this conflicted energy that you've had has definitely conflicted your person as well and they've picked up on this energy too okay um and it was not very healthy for this relationship reflection give each other some space at the moment trust and have faith that all will work out for the best so whatever is happening right now for you and this person um is happening for the best okay and for your person we have here transformation which is what i said with the death card being there there is a transformation going on um your relationship with one another is about to deepen love conquers and transforms all things i felt that this connection was gonna had the potential of going to the next level okay but i feel that somebody here um needed to go through this transformation okay somebody here was really going through a transformation here it was a learning curve playfulness laughter is the best therapy have some fun together and remember that love is the greatest healer so now somebody is healing from this connection okay um right so um pisces that was your reading okay i hope it resonated um if it didn't it simply wasn't your message um again there's plenty of other good readers out there as well so you can go and check out their channels um please don't forget to leave me a like share and subscribe because your support is immensely appreciated especially at a time like this okay um and i wish you guys all the best stay safe stay at home i love you guys a lot take care bye bye